I've got a great property here that you're going to love. It's got a four car garage and a great outdoor entertaining space, but let's not listen to me. Let's hear from Terry and Trish who have lived here for 17 long years. I'm with the vendors Trish and Terry Murphy who have lived here for almost 18 years and uh, we're going to have a little discussion about the property. Trish and Terry, can you tell me how long have you lived here? Uh, we've lived here for almost 18 years. We, okay. we moved in in January 1998. Tell us, how did you come to get the property? Well, we'd, we'd given up on wanting to buy a place. We'd looked at so many and they didn't really meet our expectations. So we said to the real estate agent, no more. But she knew exactly what we wanted and within a short while she'd come back and said, I've found exactly the place. And here we are. Why was getting the four car garage so important to you? I'm a, at that time I was car restoring and I needed a good sized garage to be able to carry on work that wasn't finished. And this, this had a, a four car garage at that, at that time. What are some of the things that you've done to the property since you've bought it? Trish is very good in the garden, so we've really improved that. Um, we basically did a lot of work in the interiors. The people prior to us owned uh, some German shepherds. The lounge and dining area was pretty bad, so we just ripped it up and lived with the floors as they were for a time. And then we decided that we would um, um, sand and, and polish them. But um, I think more Terry felt that to do that in the bedrooms it might be a bit cold, so we just recarpeted the rest of the house and, and good quality the carpet. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, and I wanted a deck because I like that indoor outdoor flow, um, and I've always wanted to have a deck. And this is north facing, so it's absolutely fantastic. So, and I love sitting on my couch in the lounge, and I can see right out, and I could never see that before. What are some of the things that you, some of the changes that you've seen in Pamir since you've lived here? Um, here, particularly, um, it's very close to the shopping shopping area there, so we can walk up. Um, the rail service now, the train is much closer to here. It was away down Island Road before, and so if you're wanting to go into the city, it's only 17 minutes on the train, so that's really good. Pamir has a um, quite a close community, you know, of its. Um, it's its own little community council thing and stuff like that. Yeah, the road is often closed off and they have little uh, events, races and community yeah. functions. Yeah. So we get detoured. Yeah. <laughs> Other people get detoured. We can't park outside yeah. our house, but yeah, yeah, we do. Well, I enjoyed that and I hope you did as well because I love this home and I know you will too. My name is Tim Golder and I'm looking forward to seeing you at the Open Homes.